of East Theater and Mitha Alamer and my guest, Chris Profi, Musically Obsessed. Hello, everybody. Of course, uh, he's been visiting me in Idaho here. We're having a great time. And um, I noticed a few weeks ago or a couple weeks ago, Frank Landry from Channel 33 RPM did a video on backward messaging in music. So I remembered a song from my childhood that had some backward messaging, so I thought it'd be interesting just to show it, kind of. So um, it's actually from this record right here, Tommy James and the Shondells, Crimson and Clover, which you wouldn't expect. So, um, yeah. No, that's like a, a, the album that you would never expect something backwards. Yeah, so there is an actual backwards message in this. It's actual, it's not just one that sounds like something, it's an actual one. So I will actually try to play it in a few minutes. And this is an interesting album. I mean, I've had this since I was a teenager and I always knew about it because of that. And I always thought it was really weird that there was a backwards song in here, or a part of a song. And um, you go ahead, you can... Yeah, so we, we looked up the message and um, I don't know if Aaron said this, but the song title is called Breakaway. And there's a part in the song where it's, it's actually backwards. So you have to play the record in reverse to hear what it says. Now, here's what it says, it's just crazy. It says, extricate the quadruped from the vehicle and constabulate into something nutritious. And when the aurora rises in the heavens, I will return and compensate thee amply. Let me read that again. Okay, so <laughs> after I read this, as Aaron said, he's going to go over to the turntable and play it for you guys. You're going to hear uh, the you know garbled, garbled up message backwards. And then he's going to reverse it, and then you're going to hear, hopefully, this. And this is what it's going to say. Extricate the quadruped from the vehicle and constabulate into something nutritious. And when the aurora arises in the heavens, I will return and compensate thee amply. Yeah. <laughs> no clue what that means, but obviously Tommy, James, and the Shondells were on something, and they're not sharing. Yeah. So, so when I was a teenager, about 14, 15, I discovered this, and I actually went to my turntable, played it, and I heard it's like that's a bunch of gibberish. That's what are they even talking about? And it still sounds kind of like a weird gibberish to me. So, yeah. I will attempt to do this. I have to do it manually, so you know I'll try to get it pretty good. We'll see what happens. So I'll play the play it forward first. Yeah. So he's gonna go over there and uh, set this up here, and I'll I'll shut up so you can hear. It. Extricate the quadruped from the vehicle and constabulate into something nutritious. And when the aurora rises in the heavens, I will return and compensate the athlete. All right, can we do that one more time? Because I want them to hear that again. That was so cool. Maybe just turn it up a little bit. Extricate the quadruped from the vehicle and constabulate into something nutritious. And when the aurora rises in the heavens, I will return and compensate the emperor. Yeah, so hopefully you guys heard that. <laughs> I'm not the best at playing, <laughs> you put my finger playing it backwards, but I tried. But uh, yeah, I always thought that was crazy, and I thought it was interesting because Frank had just done a video, and on his he showed a few, and they were kind of like, he had to stretch for it, but I knew this one was a little different, so. Yeah, so thank you to Frank over at Channel 33 RPM for kind of getting that in our head to look, and thank you to Aaron, he just remembered, he's like, oh yeah, I remember this song from my childhood. So anybody who has this record, what do you think? Have you heard that? Let us know. All right, All right. everyone. Have a good one. Adios.